hello everyone welcome to another Linux training series today i'm going to show you how you can monitor your service network traffic with a simple package called vn start this tool will help you monitor simple things like your network traffic before we get started we have to install the software on our server I have it on my local PC, so I'm going to show you how it works before I show you the installation guide. So when you have that software up and running, and you type vm start dash l, it's live data, hit enter. This will show you your live received data and your live transferred or transmitted data, All right? In seconds. Now let's close that. Put VN starts. And if you want to get an hourly report, just put VN start dash age and it's going to show you your hourly report. It will show you the time this the server was busy and the time it was free. Because this is a local machine, from this time to this time, my PC was not working okay all right so let's install this on our server so let's search into my server right into my server and we are locked into our my our server i locked in without a password because i'm using ssh keys if you want to learn how to log in or to create a passwordless login, then you can watch my security video series. All right. So next, before you install any software, it's a good practice to always update your system by running your commands. Some you you have to take a look at the operating system you are working with. If it's Alma Linux, then you see sudo dnf update and sudo dnf upgrade after that you put yes but because i'm using linux not linux ubuntu right our package manager is apt right so i put apt apt so sudo apt upgrade update and sudo apt upgrade hit enter now i'll enter my password put my password hit enter and wait for our server to upgrade Now, our server is up to date. It's then time we install our VN start package. So you simply put sudo apt install vn start vn start hit enter and this package will be installed on our server. Now that we have our VN start installed, it's then time we configure it. But before we start, we do the configuration, we have to first check the status of our software VN start. So sudo system ctl status VN start and our software is active. Now we have to enable it on system boot so I simply close that by holding Control C. Now, what we want to do is we want to type sudo systemctl 
enable right you see enable vn start hit enter and this software will be enabled on system startup now let's configure the software before we configure vn start we need to know the interface we want to monitor for this you have to type ip address right and we're going to show like this and let's take a look at the interface we want to monitor we have this interface and this interface now this interface is for your network so what you do is you simply you can copy it all right you can copy it and we're going into our configuration file now where do we get our config file to get it get cd into rules and inside here we're going to cd into the xc directory and inside the xc directory we want to also go into the vn start so we'll get the list and see if we'll, we'll get the vn start which is here right so vn start and we'll be using a text editor called nano so we'll just type nano and we we'll put the name of this that's vn start config hit enter now i want to scroll to interface so you see this interface we we'll remove it and we're going to monitor and the interface we just copied we paste it here all right so we just paste it here let me redo that okay so we simply paste it inside here after that control s and control x now let's restart vn start so sudo system ctl system ctl restart v and start vn starts hit enter and vn start is restarted now that we are done with the configuration let's clear our screen and see how we can run commands to monitor stuff on our server just type vn start all right so just type vn start enter and it's going to give you your monthly report daily report and a lot of stuff here you can monitor okay you can equally run vn start hyphen h and it's going to show you your hourly report so the h stands for hour if you want daily you simply you type the same thing and put d and it's going to give you your daily report remember this is the interface we are monitoring to also know your monthly report you simply run the same command vn starts and instead of day or you put m that's your monthly next up we have y as yearly and we have l as your life report so this will give you a real-time report okay and one final thing i want to give you to risk their resource okay they are man page or the manual page so what we do is vn start vn start dash dash just put help and hit enter and it's going to show you commands that you can run so for five minute interval just put five hourly hourly graph daily monthly all right a lot of things here so that's how easy it is to monitor your network traffic with 
this simple package called VN Start. I hope you liked the video. In my next series of videos, I'll sh be showing you more things about Linux. If you like content like this, you can subscribe to the channel, join the community we are building. Thank you and have a lovely learning experience. Bye-bye.